All right, so. Make it easy for me. Super easy. The integration piece is weird compared to other integrations on it. That's the reason why I'm actually bringing this up. So I'm gonna go and look at a meeting that I had with Jojo Laricia. Okay, so what happened is Jojo scheduled a meeting with me and Fathom is attached to your Zoom links. So anytime you pull up a Zoom meeting, Fathom is gonna be, be available. All right, Fathom is the only one that I know of that's directly integrated with HubSpot right now. This is the main benefit for this particular note taker. I'm not endorsing this because I get paid for it. It's actually free right now for the individual, just so we're clear on this. Everything I'm showing you works on the free tier of HubSpot and the free note taker piece that they give you, okay? So I'm gonna go into JoJo. She's a contact in my database. Then I'm gonna to go to the meeting that we held. I'm gonna click on meetings. And then I'm gonna look at the summary that popped in on this contact in my database. The first thing, it summarizes with AI the topics that we covered, not the, the actual transcript. So it reads what we went over and then summarizes it for you. That's what's embedded here. Okay, so these are all the notes summarized from the meeting. It drops the actual recording on your contact record and it gives you access to the live video that's recorded here. So when you scroll through here, you can pull out minutes from it and I can jump to any area that I am interested in looking at. Okay, so top down is how I'm working. Second, it transcripts it. Now I wanna be clear on this. I was with a guy that had a super thick French accent. He was Canadian. I'm like, no way this transcript's gonna work. Word for word, it worked perfectly. It worked very, very well. So if it's semi-English speaking person you're talking to, it works, all right? Remove that objection. The second thing is the transcript is here, the video is here, and then your AI summary is here. Now, for those of us that make YouTube videos from any of our one-to-one -one calls, this is your description <laughs> typed for you with keyword rich text. So you can copy this, post your video on YouTube and put this in the description. You might need to augment it slightly, but it saves a ton of time. Last, the questions that we asked are all here. Back and forth, we were having conversations. Anytime a question was asked, it's dropped here. And what it does is it lets you go down to the question in the video. It jumps to where the question was asked. So it jumps straight to where you were at with the minute mark. For a salesperson who is shitty at taking notes, this is a freaking dream. <laughs> I love this it. This is a freaking dream. Like this is an add on for my business, because I take notes, I have like a million of these that are scribbled like, I don't know if you can see my drawings and stuff, but it's like two months ago, there's no way I'd know what that means. It's all right here and it integrates pretty well, okay? Now, if you get it, the integration is in a weird spot. You have to go to customization and then you scroll down and it says learn more right here. You do not integrate from the app marketplace on HubSpot. You integrate from within the Fathom application back to HubSpot. That hung me up for a little while. The integration also takes a few hours to take place. So don't think that five minutes before the call, you're gonna get the note taker. It takes a minute to connect. This is a new product. It is in funding right now. They're asking for VC up until tomorrow. So this is as new as it gets and it's as good as I've seen for any product that's on the market and it's still free. Wow. Okay. Keep that in mind, Lynn. What's um, the link? I just downloaded this yesterday and I'm a little confused. Somebody told me today that if you have meetings that are booked like recurring meetings, even if you don't attend them, Fathom shows up, is that correct? That is correct. How you, can you turn it off? Uh, yes, there's a setting in there that says don't automatically join, but you have to remember to join it. So you have to do that for every recurring meeting or one at a time? So 
under the settings right here, auto record all scheduled meetings, you turn this off. Okay. And, but you have to remember to turn it on when you're in your meeting. So dumb people like me that forget to do a lot of things because we got tons of stuff going on. I'm not gonna remember to click record, so I just leave it on. As far as the Fathom note taker going in the meeting, the host doesn't need to let it in or they can remove it. That's what I do with Ian, what I was doing with Ian's initially because he stopped coming. So do these, do these recordings and transcripts, do those links stay there forever? Yes, as long as the server that it's held on is still active. So it seems that this product is gonna be live forever now. You can do this share thing too, that's pretty cool. There's a couple other amenities associated with it. So like I can sync to HubSpot from here for this and then I can actually copy this and share it. And then I, this link, I can share it and they get a video with the transcript down below it too for anybody that attended your meeting also. Do you connect it with your Google Calendar? Yes or no? Yeah, 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 you do. So if it's your Zoom number and I'm on a call with you, can I record it or does it have to be? Yes, you can so, drop it. So down. any Zoom, okay. Yep. Okay, so um, Mark, the other day, Di uh, Diane, I don't know, maybe you're here or not, maybe you didn't see my, my text to you, but I wanted to introduce Diana to somebody who's pretty high tech. If I, if, if I'm on a call with Diana and I have Fathom running, can I take a clip from that and then send it to the person I want to introduce her to because she can say what she does better than I can. I was in Diana's meeting and I was practicing with it and I did highlights for the meeting. You see these highlights? Mm -hmm. On Monday, I went through and said, this is JoJo's celebration. And then it summarized the celebration for me. This is Nancy Delaney's celebration. I actually hit highlight, typed in Nancy Delaney's celebration, and then it clipped it and AI corrected it. So it gave the summation of what they said in their 30 second commercial. You gotta learn to use it. There's some tricks to it in, those, in these multifaceted meetings with a ton of people, but it does work. It's pretty cool how it works. When you're not in a breakout room, it works really well. When you're in just an open networking meeting, bring it in and highlight everybody. And then it drops their summaries in. And you can then take that summary, copy it and paste it and put it in the words they say about themselves in your CRM. Oh, wow. Oh, right? cool. If yeah, you tokenize awesome. emails in template, you can say what they do is a token, it's your property and you can use that in your templated emails. There's a ton of different ways to use this. Wow. It's a monster. It really is. And it integrates with the free tier of HubSpot. So you're still at $0 when it comes to this product, just so we're all clear on that.